Hey guys, illustrator, artist Joshua Woodridge here. And um, today I thought I'd do something a little bit different for y'all. Right now I'm working on um, this illustration of the Duchess from um, the new book coming out, Adventures of Alice in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll, rewritten by Stacey Demeron, uh, all written and illustrated by myself. And uh, right now I'm working on the Duchess and um, Sorry, the video is kind of awkward looking because I have it propped up on a cup. <laughs> but uh, this is the Duchess, my uh, version of the Duchess. And uh, as you can see, she's um, she's holding a little baby, which is a pig. And the baby is screaming and crying. And the Duchess looks like she's uh, freaking out. Um, I gave the Duchess, I mean, she just had a baby. I mean, I'll, I'll tell you what, uh, I'll explain to you how, what my thought process was when, when, uh, creating her. But, um, but first I want to say that, uh, I don't know uh, who's read Lewis Carroll, um, Alice in Wonderland, Alice's Adventures in Wonderland, but Lewis Carroll, when he wrote, um, this book, during that time, he was uh, poking fun, like making jibes at society and uh, everything that went on during his time. So these characters, the Duchess, the Queen, uh, these different characters were inspired by society and his uh, ideas on it. Um, so during our, my time, this uh, Duchess right here is um, she's a, she's inspired by a woman who is uh, kind of more she's she's more worried about her look more than anything else you know her face is inspired by uh, reconstruction <laughs> her um her style this book this retake on this story that is written by Stacy did a take uh, Louisiana style version of it. So, you know, Louisiana, we're, we're um, founded on French, Creole, Cajun. And so this Duchess has a little French vibe to her. You know, I gave her a, a stylish hairstyle from France would be like a duchess hairstyle but I bammed it up way up obviously and um, put big bows all over and I, I wanted her to look um, someone who is uh, so on the edge of fashion that she literally is about to fall off the edge so I gave her pink hair um, really big covered in bows she's gonna be all dressed in pink and uh, I, and I gave her a more youthful look. I mean, she just had a baby, but you know, ever since I was a kid, there was something about the Duchess that was like watching from movies and um, the book. And uh, as a kid, I always found the Duchess to be very scary. She was always portrayed as like this ugly woman that um, very scary, big mouth. Uh, and there was something about her that was like very interesting because she had always had an interesting look. Uh, she was always strange to me. I mean, she's she her cook is throwing pepper at them and she doesn't care and she's she's um, tossing her baby around like it's nothing. But. Uh, but I decided to give this this Duchess a youthful appearance to uh, make her a little bit different, and I thought it would be funny to, instead of her hat looking. I mean, she does; she's not very pretty, obviously, in this illustration. But I thought it'd be funny to give her uh, um, kind of like a uh, like I said, 
her face has been reconstructed. I mean, her high, very high, big cheekbones, narrow chin, which in the book she's got a pointy chin, but a you narrow know, chin, big lips, you know. So I gave her that look. And um, when I, when I, when she's first shown in this illustration, I'm gonna have her looking like this. When you know the second time when she's shown in the book, I'll have her in some completely different, some completely different other hair color, hairstyle. When she goes to play croquet with the queen. Pretty uh, outrageous look. And this, uh, I'm looking at this camera on my phone. It's not really doing the illustration justice. The it's making the colors really dark and muddy looking. But my illustration doesn't look like that right now. It's a little bit more vibrant and uh, cleaner looking. So I'm very excited about this book. I, when me and, uh, when I talked to Stacy, I, I, I always wanted to um, illustrate the classic, classic fairy tales and classic stories. And, uh, I've, I've always, always wanted to do my illustration style version of Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. And I talked to Stacy, and she was all for it. So she rewrote, retold the story, Louisiana style. It's got a French vibe to it, Louisiana vibe to it. And uh, so I was really excited about it. And I've read through it, and it's very, um, it's very funny, you know. And of course, it still holds to Lewis Carroll. You know, it's got a little twist to it. And I think a lot of. Uh, you know, not just kids, but also young adults and also adults will enjoy this book as well. This book will be like a, a, a novel, a, a novella form. And hopefully it'll be available sometimes um, this year. That's my plan. So I'm working on these uh, illustrations first chance, every chance I get. So I'm gonna finish painting this and then I will go into uh, inking it and then going to kind of embellishing it with color pencil and then I will scan it in and then go into vamping it up a little, cleaning up a little digitally. Digitally, I can never say that right. So yeah, this is it so far. And I'll keep you all updated as I go. See you. So here is the Duchess. <clears throat> I finished. With her screaming baby, baby piglet. <laughs>